In a startling turn of events, several prominent opposition leaders made grave accusations against the government, claiming that they are targets of an alleged state-sponsored phone hacking attempts. The leaders include TMC MP Mahua Moitra, Congress leader Shashi Tharoor and Pawan Khera, Aam Aadmi Party leader Raghav Chadda and Shiv Sena UBT faction MP Priyanka Chaturvedi. Now, these leaders took to social media to reveal that they had received notifications from Apple warning them of potential state-sponsored attackers seeking access to their mobile devices and emails. Following these claims, Priyanka Chaturvedi also wrote to the Prime Minister and the Home Minister urging their immediate intervention. She stressed the urgency of addressing what she described as an attempt to breach her phone. जी जिस तरीके से रात को मुझे ये वार्निंग आई है मैं 15-20 साल से एप्पल यूजर रही हूँ कभी इस तरीके की वार्निंग नहीं आई है तो दिखाता है किस तरह और बहुत स्पष्ट तरीके से कहा है स्टेट स्पॉन्सर्ड है ये जो अटैक हो रहे हैं स्टेट स्पॉन्सर्ड हैं हमारा स्टेट कौन सरकार कौन तो वो क्लियरली ये बता रहा है ये केंद्र सरकार की तरफ से प्रायोजित कार्यक्रम है और इस पर आप सावधानी बरतिए और आज सवेरे जब पता चला कि बहुत सारे अपोजिशन के एम हैं जिनको इस तरीके की ईमेल आई है वार्निंग आई है तो मैं बस यही कहूंगी कि इस पर जांच होनी चाहिए और केंद्र सरकार को इस पर स्पष्टीकरण देना चाहिए एप्पल का नोटिस आता है मैंने इसको थोड़ा आपके लिए बड़ा करके दिखाया है देखिए अच्छी तरह देखिए ये तोते का काम है राइट इसमें लिखा है एप्पल बिलीव you are being targeted by state sponsors sponsored attackers who are trying to remotely compromise the iphone associated with your apple id ab ye mere office mein sab logon ko mila hai venu gopal ji ko mila hai congress party mein list bani hui hai pawan khera supriya sitaram yachuri akhilesh yadav प्रियंका चतुर्वेदी महुआ मोहित्रा राघव चड्डा टी एस सिंह देवलिस्ट है और ये सारे के सारे किसी ना किसी तरीके से इस मामले में इन्वॉल्व है और देश के युवाओं को मैं समझाना चाहता हूं बताना चाहता हूं यहां हो क्या रहा है आपका ध्यान कभी इधर ले, ले जाते हैं कभी उधर ले जाते हैं कभी इधर ले जाते हैं आपके दिल के अंदर गुस्सा पैदा करते हैं और जब आपके दिल में नफरत आती है गुस्सा आता है जो आपका भविष्य है जो इस देश की पूंजी है जो इस देश का धन है उसको उठा के ये लोग ले जाते हैं ये नहीं इसी आरोप क्यों कह रहे हैं मैसेज अलर्ट आ चुका है सरकार न कहे कि ये अलर्ट गलत है डिजिटल दुनिया बना रहे हैं और पर इन्वे, इन्वेसिव पॉलिटिक्स के तहत अब देखना चाहते हैं कौन किससे बात कर रहा क्या बात कर रहा पूरा का पूरा नॉर्थ कोरिया बनने जा रहा है सरकार की ओर से अभी तक कुछ सुना ही नहीं मैंने उनकी ओर से सफाई आनी चाहिए ना इसका एक मंत्रालय भी है वो क्या कर रहा अभी कुछ ऑनरेबल एम और कुछ कई अन्य सिटीजन्स ने जो मुद्दा उठाया है कि उनके पास एप्पल से एक अलर्ट आया है उसके बारे में मैं आपको क्लियरली कहना चाहता हूं कि सरकार इस मुद्दे पर बहुत कंसर्न्ड है और इस मुद्दे के तह तक जाएंगे हमने इसमें इन्वेस्टिगेशन ऑर्डर कर दिया है ऑलरेडी और इन्वेस्टिगेशन करके तह तक जाएंगे मैं साथियों आपके सामने एक और विषय रखना चाहूंगा इस देश में कुछ हमारे कंपल्सिव क्रिटिक्स हैं जिनको आदत लग गई है कोई भी मुद्दा हो जब नींद खुले तब उठ के क्रिटिसाइज करो
Now, Apple in a statement clarified that the threat notification sent to several iPhone users in India, including the opposition leaders, are not attributed to specific state-sponsored attackers. In a statement, the tech giant explained that state-sponsored attackers are well-funded and highly sophisticated with their methods constantly evolving and detecting such attacks relies on imperfect and incomplete threat intelligence signals, making it impossible for some Apple threat notification to be false alarms or for certain attacks to go undetected, the company said. However, Apple refrained from divulging any further specific reasons behind issuing these threat notifications, saying it could potentially aid state-sponsored attackers in evading future detection. My colleague Sabisachi is joining me on the phone line to get us more details. So, well, Sabisachi, while the opposition leaders are mounting attack on the government, saying that this is yet another bit of a snooping on them, the IT minister, Ashwini Vaishnav, has made it very clear that he is going to order an investigation into this entire matter and go to the root of it. But he also maintains that there are certain elements within the opposition party who compulsorily are critics of the government. Well, absolutely. See, the BJP has been uh, maintaining it from the beginning. Uh, when the opposition party MPs were raising uh, concerns regarding this and attacking the central government, uh, the BJP earlier said that if these MPs have a problem, they can go, go to a police station and register an FIR. Uh, and uh, these MPs should wait for the official confirmation from uh, Apple itself without uh, pre-assuming anything. And that's what... That Ash Ashwini Vaishnav pointed out that uh, he would uh, uh, order for an investigation regarding it and he would find out the root cause as well. Uh, but he also said that the opposition parties are uh, currently just on a mode to criticize the central government for anything. And uh, we have seen not only Ash Ashwini Vaishnav but several other BJP leaders who have reacted to it. Uh, they have also questioned the timing of. Uh, uh, the particular uh, snooping allegations that uh, the opposition parties have leveled against the central government. Uh, we have seen reaction coming in from Rahul Gandhi, from Moa Mitro, uh, from Priyanka Chaturvedi. Uh, they all have raised concerns regarding it. And also they have pointed out at the Pegasus issue as well. Uh, TMC, on the other hand, TMC have said that it is very unfortunate that uh, this thing is happening and this is not the democracy that uh, the people of the country want. And uh, uh, TMC also pointed out that uh, during the Supreme Court, uh, when the Pegasus issue was going on, the Supreme Court had to stay the uh, inquiry. And the TMC says that it is very unfortunate. And BJP attacked, uh, counter-attacked Rahul Gandhi, stating that Rahul Gandhi can submit his phone whenever he wants. Because when the Supreme Court had asked uh, that the committee uh, with the Supreme Court formed uh, to uh, investigate the Pegasus issue, uh, that that particular committee had asked uh, the mobile phones of Rahul Gandhi to be submitted. And that time he didn't, and that's what the BJP have been raising. Absolutely, Sir Thank you for getting us all those details. We shall leave it at that for the moment.